darkspawn stragglers, but no... Yes, my lady? Who might you be? Here with Andrea, you may call, it, call me Elandrea. Yeah. I am Sir Bryant, commander of Lothering's remaining Templars. You don't seem like the other refugees. Are you one of Arl Eamon's knights? Um, I'm a Grey Warden, actually. I see. Tan Loghain declared all Grey Wardens traitors responsible for the King's death. You know this, I hope. Um, he claimed we're responsible? And set a bounty on any who survived. Ah, that's I awkward. don't believe the Grey Wardens would be as careless or malicious as the Tan claims. But either way, there it is. Hmm. It is best you not linger, though. Just in case. Right. Um, about those bandits outside the village. Maker's breath. How many times must we drive them off? Um. But there are more. There are more, though, in the forest, yeah, according to that board. But are these two separate cases? Don't bother you again. I killed them. You need to watch those more carefully. Um. Yeah. Uh, we can barely keep order here in the village. Savaral, those fool bandits have returned. Take some men and drive them off and see if you can't capture that leader of theirs this time. As you command, Sir Brian. Wait, can I interject? I beat the ones outside immediately, like, uh, mm. No, unless there's something else you need. Well, things seem very dire in the village. They are. With the ban having taken his men north, the village is left to its fate. We will evacuate as many as we can before the horde reaches us. I will stay as long as I am needed. Now, unless there's something else you need. Uh -huh. Any other help? Oh, no, that's the he can offer. I don't want help from him. Information? If the matter is important, certainly. Grab I have to sneeze. Okay, it did that thing where it's like, wait, maybe I don't. But then I did. Um, any recent news? Sure. Other than the Darkspawn Horde bearing down on us, none of it is good. Teon Loghain is set to declare himself king, I hear. Disaster piled on disaster. Fine. Can Caitlin had no heir? None that we know of. Teon Loghain has no legitimate claim on the throne. He may be a hero, and his daughter may be queen, but he is a commoner. And the king's corpse is barely cold. For real, and his if fault too. If Eamon was able to intervene, perhaps it would not have gone this far. I do not care who takes the throne. Only fools fight over who owns a cottage while it burns down around them. Right. Um, what's wrong with Arl Eamon? Arl Eamon has fallen ill, mm. and his knights are on a quest for the sacred urn filled with Andraste's ashes, said to cure any malady. He must be very ill if they chase miracles as the only cure. One of the Arl's knights, Sir Donal, is here searching for fantasies while... Exactly. The Ask Handler MHW, exactly. Okay, well, I'm gonna go then. Travel safely, and may the Maker watch over you. And you as well. Okay. I came from that way. And when the Maker spoke, a chant of light you ever scattered wonder in the darkness. That's an accurate likeness of Andraste. And Maybe she was ugly. Maybe she had buck teeth. Maybe she was ugly. You never know, I suppose. Well, I don't think this is quite the place that I I'm wanted sorry, to be. I cannot talk now. I must feed the holy brazier to ensure the flame never dies. Um, what's the significance? It represents the flames that burned Andraste herself. Do you know the tale? No? Um... Let's go with number two. The fires cleanse their sins, something of that sort. The prophet was burned in the ancient city of Minrakos before the ancient mages she had fought. Instead of dying in pain as the mages wanted, she was purified by the fire and taken by the maker into the heavens to stand forever at his side. Oh. We are all sinners. The fire symbolizes our hope that forgiveness is possible. Thus, we all serve by feeding its flames. Interesting. Aren't there easier ways to keep a fire going? So if I sin, I should just set myself on fire. I'll leave you alone then. I wish you well. Yeah, you too, man. I'm sorry, but I must prepare the Chantry's back before we flee. There is very little time. Cool. I read it. I really want to go find a shop now. 
That's my current plan. Oh. Should I talk to you? Who? I beg your pardon. I did not see you approach. Sir Donald? Is that you? Alistair? By the maker, how are you? I, I was certain you were dead. Not yet. No thanks to turn Loghain. If Arl Eamon were well, he'd set Loghain straight soon enough. So you're here looking for the urn of sacred ashes, then? I am indeed. Andraste's ashes are said to cure any illness. But I fear we are chasing a fable, with each day my hope dims. Don't blame ya. Um, shouldn't you be fleeing the Darkspawn? I was hoping to meet Arl Eamon, in fact. So your quest for the ashes brought you here? Tell me more about this urn of sac your sacred ashes. Sure. Supposedly, the urn contains the ashes of the prophetess Andraste. Surely you know all this. Um, I'd like to hear what you've learned. If you're truly interested, there are books here containing a great deal of lore. Nothing I have found leads me to believe that this was anything more than a quest of desperation. Mm. I intend to return to Redcliffe soon and tell the Arlesa exactly that once Sir Henrik arrives. About that. Um, yeah. What? And you have his locket? And a note? Maker's mercy. Thank you for giving me these. I would never have known otherwise. <laughs> Thank you for looting my friend's corpse. <laughs> Um, sorry about your friend. Thank you. I wonder how many of us have met similar fates on this mad quest. Um, I was hoping to meet Arleman. Why is that, if I may ask? Um, um, I don't know if I should just straight up say like, yeah, we're kind of looking to overthrow him. I would prefer not to say. Whatever the reason, Arl won't be seeing anyone until he's recovered. I don't like the sound of that. We should see Arl Eamon for ourselves and find out what's happening. You can travel to Redcliffe if you like. Perhaps he has recovered. Or perhaps his son might assist you. If nothing else, I am certain you would be welcomed at Castle Redcliffe. The Arlesa is there, and she could tell you more than I could. Okay. Um... So your quest for ashes brought you here? Sure, why not? I'll talk a little more. I expect you to take advantage of the Chantry's library, in fact. But my skills are better suited to battle than chasing down tales. Shouldn't you be fleeing the Darkspawn? My mission takes priority. But I fear I shall be returning to Redcliffe with nothing to show for my efforts. Shame that. All right, well, with good Henrik talking. gone, I need to return to Redcliffe. Perhaps later I will seek out the scholar his note mentions. But I must go. Thank you again, my lady. You have been most helpful. Okay. Well, there he goes. Cool. Quest completed. Go me. Still haven't found a shop. But that's... We're probably about to find one here in this town that's, like, falling apart. You never know. I brought my family to Lothering, I brought because, my family I to Lothering because I thought it would be safe. So it's just multiple people saying the same line. As if we needed more fighting here. Back off. I have the right to charge what I wish. You profit from their misfortune. I should have the Templars give away everything in your class. It's a bad sign. You wouldn't dare. Any of you step too close to my goods and I'll... It's so nice to see everyone working together in a crisis. Warms the heart. Oh, you there. You look able. Would you care to make a tiny profit helping a beleaguered businessman? What are you saying? Tell us yourselves, I'm not getting involved. I want to help you. Get rid of the tiny part and I'll consider it. Is your profiteering? Er, ruffling some feathers? Uh, sure. You could say that, yes. The nerve of these people. He is charging outlandish prices for things people desperately need. Their blood is filling his pockets. That sounds his unsanitary. Only survival of the fittest. All of these Cretans would do the same in his shoes, given the chance. Mm. I have limited supplies. The people decide what those supplies are worth to them. You bought most of your wares from these very people last week. Now they flee for their lives, and you want to talk business? Look, stranger, I have a hundred silvers if you drive this rabble off, starting with that priest. I'm an honest merchant, nothing more. Um, agreed. Those of you not here to do business, leave now. 
You don't think you're being unscrupulous? That one. Would it help these folks if they could buy no goods at all? They spend their very last coin because they are desperate. And this man preys upon them as surely as the bandits outside the city. Ah, I'm not arguing anymore. Drive off this woman and get your hundred silvers. Otherwise, I'm taking my wagon and leaving. Um, fair enough. Time to go priest. I think you can compromise and still make a profit. No. Lower your prices or lose your goods. Uh, then go if that's what you wish. I hope the darkspawn choke on your cheap hides. Ah. I suppose it couldn't be helped. Make her help us all. Rip. Okay. A few knights have come through here searching for some holy artifact. Not one of them stopped to help. So is that all that's in this area? No, there's a bridge. So let's talk about your mother for a moment. I'd rather we actually talk about to talk? your mother. My there beloved cheese. Besides, <laughs> thank you for following. Your mother, a scary witch who lives in the middle of a forest, much more interesting. To you, perhaps, you would find the moss growing upon a stone. This is actually important. You know what's more interesting than that? Apostates, mages outside of the tower. That's illegal, you know. You did not read that in a book somewhere, did you? I hope the small letters did not strain you over much. Oh, we could not talk about your mother. That works for me. Okay, dialogue over. What? What is it? Hello, um, stranger. I don't suppose you know anyone that can make traps. Traps? What do you need traps for? Old man Barlin said that Darkspawn may be coming soon. He's got traps on his farm. I figured I'd put a few on my lands. Barlin wants to poison his traps. I just want normal traps. Um, Barlin has poison traps on his land. Sure, I'll ask. Oh, he doesn't have any poison yet, thank the maker. So his fields are just full of traps. He can be a bit eccentric. He's just afraid of the dark spawn. Um, why don't you just buy some? None to be had. Barlin has all the traps in the village in his fields. Sorry, I can't make traps. I, I didn't mean to bother you. Sorry. That's fine. I know that, like, there are traps on the bandit corpses, I'm pretty sure, so as soon as I can make some bloody inventory space, I can talk to you again. You've got a bed for the night. You taken care of. <laughs> she looks a lot like me. Except older. <laughs> okay. Um. I actually was more hoping I could help you. I think I'm a refugee. What? What's going on here? Yeah, that one. Don't need blades right now. We need beds, food, and an end to all these sad sots. I don't suppose you know anything of tonics, medicines, or herbs. Um, I don't, but my friend does. Then you may be able to do us a lot of good. All manner of travelers come through, many injured or sick. We do our best, but we're out of supplies. There's medicinal herbs in the woods to the north. If you make a few poultices, I'll scrape together some sort of payment. I'll write all you need to know in this note here. Okay, cool. More than just plants. What do you wish of me? Nothing! It's the same button to move and to talk and to do everything in this game. Okay, um, can't open that because I'm not a rogue. I found one merchant, and of course he's a dickwad, and I had to Tell just let him leave. Morgan, did you live there in that forest oh, brother, your entire life? Girl. I left it on occasion, but Hopefully I always returned. Why? Is that so strange? It was my home. But it was just you and your Jeez, mother there. Where, sh no one else. Just give me a Not shop. Occasionally had Why can't I have a done. single shop? What? Company? Do I even want to ask? No. All right. No, well. Really don't. Could I fast travel somewhere where there's a shop? Is that a thing I can do? How do I go anywhere else? I cannot travel at this time. Cool. What do you need? Nothing. Bugger off! Alright. 
That's so frustrating how it's constantly doing that. Need help? Yeah, if you know where a shop is in this area, go ahead and tell me. Because that's... I, I just want to sell stuff. Is this a shop? I heard Maybe. Were... Maybe he'll buy stuff. It's a building I can go into. That's something new. Well, look what we have here, then. I think we've just been blessed. Uh-oh. Low gains, men. This can't be good. Mm, probably not. Didn't we spend all morning asking about an elf by this very description? And everyone said they hadn't seen one. It seems hey, Jolteon. Welcome to the stream. Gentlemen, surely there's no need for trouble. These are no doubt simply more poor souls seeking refuge. They're more than that. Now stay out of our way, sister. You protect these traitors, you'll get the same as them. Looks like he wants to fight. I'm happy to oblige. What makes you think we're traitors? I don't mind your help, miss. Please stand back. Or I don't need your help, miss, rather. Let's talk about this before things get out of hand. Um, what makes you think we're traitors? Tern Logan claims the Grey Wardens betrayed the king. Or haven't you heard? That's not how Enough it happened. Talk. Take the warden into custody. Kill the sister and anyone else that gets in your way. Well, these guys are dead then. Let's make this quick. Oh, and she actually is helping us. Well, all right. So, first on you, I'm just gonna knock you down if possible. Um, and we'll start attacking this guy. Same with you, puppy. Attack him. I just realized that there's like everyone in here is fighting. I'm already going to die. Oh, it was just him. I feel like I wasted a bit of a, a poultice there, but. Hey, Majora. Welcome to the stream. I'm okay, thanks. How are you? Good to learn lesson. We have to stop. We can all stop fighting. I don't want them reporting to Logan. The Great Wardens didn't betray King um, Kaelin. Logan did. They aim to butcher us. They deserve no mercy. Yeah, number two. I was there. The Terran pulled us out of a trap. The Terran left the king to die. Um, you really are blind. Kill them. The Terran left the king to die. Yeah. The wardens led the king to his death. The Terran could do nothing. Um, start running right now. Yes, thank you, thank you. He I apologize for interfering. Turn his tune real quickly. But I couldn't just sit by and not help. And who are you anyhow? It's alright, I was happy to save your life. I appreciate what you tried to do. So I see, what does a sister learn to fight like that? I um, appreciate what you tried to do. I am glad you found it in your heart to offer those men mercy. Let me introduce myself. I am Liliana, one of the lay sisters of the Chantry here in Lothering. Oh, I was. Glad to hear that, Majora. I'm just telling you one for me. What does that mean? Melandrea, pleasure. You can call me Melandrea if you want. Uh, number three. They said you I'm were not a great a warden. I'm surprised you're an elf. But elves must want the blight defeated as much as humans, no? Yeah, of I course. I know after what happened, you will need all the help you can get. That's why I'm coming along. Without asking. Cool. I'm sorry, sister, but you are very mistaken. Why so eager to come with me? I will need help, that's true. Um, just what help would you be to me? Um, these men were mistaken. I'm no great warden. Why so eager? The maker told me to. Oh, well, I mean, if God tells you to, to come with me, I, I guess. Right, I believe this is where I back away slowly. Can you elaborate? The maker's on my side. Welcome aboard, then. Can you elaborate? I... I know that sounds absolutely insane. But it's true. I had a dream. A vision. Mm -hmm. More crazy? I thought we were all full up. Look at the people here. They are lost in their despair. And this darkness, this chaos, will spread. The Maker doesn't want no, this. No, of course not. What you do, what you are meant to do, is the Maker's work. Let me help. Very well. Not sure my help when it is offered. I need more than prayers, I'm afraid. Um, you feel sorry for the people? Help them here. I don't need your help. I mean... Yeah, I, th I feel like she would be better off here, but... I, you know, I don't want to turn down a party member, because I'm afraid they'll actually be turned down, you know? 
Perhaps your skull was cracked worse than Mother thought. Thank you. I appreciate being given this chance. I will not let you down. Wait, so I can only have so many then? She's a rogue, eh? Wait, I can have every... No, I can only have... Indeed. Okay. You stay here, puppy. Thanks. And he's just gone, just like that. As you said. Well, all right. Um. Cool. So now we have a rogue. Can I freaking sell something? Hey, you. Gonna make more trouble? We've about all we can stand in Lothering now. The blood mechanics are gratuitous. Yeah. <laughs> Now I can equip Liliana. That's true. Um, sorry about the mess. They had it coming, and they were troubling up themselves. So, so long as you don't start more, I won't get excited. That is a big right bottle. Then, name's Denial. Sorry I can't chat much. As you see, we were four halves. Yeah, no worries. I'm not supposed to have any rooms. Have you heard any rumors? Who were those men I fought exactly? When Tian Logang marched by, he left those fellas behind to look for Grey Wardens. I suppose that's you. Um, yes it is. I have no qualm with you, whatever the turn says. My grandfather served. Your secret's safe with me. Thank you, sir. What can I get you then? Um, I don't think I need rooms. So, rumors. I hear news from Dinnerham that Tian Logan has been declared the new regent. It makes sense. His daughter being the queen. Anything else I can get you? Uh, now I guess I'm good. Luck speed your way. Thanks. Thought I was gonna be able to sell stuff to you. A little disappointed that I apparently can't. Hey, do you sell anything? I'll have no fighting in my kitchen. Out with you. Fine. As I live and breathe, you're the Grey Warden everyone's been talking about. People have been talking about me? I represent the Blackstone Irregulars. We're a mercenary company that fell on hard times after the war with Orlais. Gotcha. I'm sure you know that times are getting worse every day. With your help, the Irregulars could be of use to Ferelden once more. Um, how can I be of service? Our leaders thought you might be willing to help. Each of our posts in Ferelden will contain letters addressed to you. Unlike most who work with us, you're getting letters straight from Raelnor and Taura, our leaders. I hope this tells you how highly the Irregulars regard the Grey Wardens. Go on. Thank you. When you've completed a mission, just return to me or any of our members stationed at an Irregulars post. We'll make sure your efforts are rewarded. Make us blessings light your path. So am I just like an honorary mercenary then for them? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I heard what you did with the other merchant. Got what he deserved. <laughs> Because I still don't have food to sell. But you do sell stuff. All right. Yes. <laughs> All right, let's sell things we don't need. Uh, bloody heck, what do I not need? The bartender did have a glorious mustache, you're right, yeah. I mean, I'll keep the staff, I guess, in case. Um, I don't need this other great sword. So let's sell that. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I can't just drag and drop it. Okay. I don't think I need this dagger, because I have an enchanted one. Yeah, give me eight silver. Why not? Um, the mace is two. I don't... Let's see. So the mace actually, hover over it, is five. And the axe is better. See, I'll just sell this. Or these. And here I have all this other stuff. And look at that blood dragon plate. Four gold, that's ridiculous. Um, don't think I need this, and 16 silver is pretty nice. I have a gold now, guys! I have a whole gold! It's been way too long since you cut one of my streams. Well, welcome to the stream then, CJB256. <laughs> Glad you're able to make it to this one. Um... I mean, I guess I'll... Yeah, I want to keep that. Oh, dang, that's almost a full gold itself? What? 
interesting. I mean, I think I can get away with selling these, because the only one who's using a shield right now is Alistair, and he... I didn't think I had anything that was better for him. Um, let me check my stuff really quickly, because I don't remember that chainmail. Yeah, so this is better than what I was wearing. Cool. I guess I should check her really quickly. She is currently just wearing robes. But she's using a dagger. How does her dagger compare to my enchanted dagger? It's the same. Okay, cool. Um, does she have... I need to check her skills. Can I do that? I mean, I can. I just don't really know how. Hold on. I found out. Oh, but I guess this wasn't exactly the same thing that I meant. What is this button? Nothing. So, clicking on you, and spells and talents, is that what I'm- Yeah, that's what I wanted, I think. More. Dirty fighting. The rogue incapacitates a target who takes no damage from the attack, but is stunned for a short time. Um, the rogue delivers a swift and unsportsmanlike kick to the target, dealing normal combat damage as well as imposing penalties to defense and movement speed unless the target passes a physical resistance check. Um, you got deft hands. This is what's, what lets you open locks. Good. Okay. But now, dual weapons. You're not doing dual weapons. You're just doing one so far. Or maybe there's just not a thing for dual weapons. You actually have more points in archery than anything. And it would be good to have an archer, I think. More than it would be to have someone with a dagger. So let's go in and change that. I will give you this bow instead. Cool. Um, I don't think I need to give you that necessarily. Let's give you all this studded leather stuff. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna feel so defended. Studded leather boots. Studded leather armor. She's got that set bonus too. Cool. Okay. Well, that's better at least. Going back to me. Let's get rid of that wedding ring again. And then we can sell a little bit more. Hear about food. Take it up with that bleeding run by the chantry. I got other gear to sell. Sounds good. Mostly because I want to sell stuff to you. I don't think we're going to need this axe. What is this? Small clear spirit crystal. It's just so expensive. Requires 26 strength. I feel like I'm... I, that might be an item that I got, like, from... Um, a DLC. Who am I on right now? Because I want to see how stuff compares to what I'm currently wearing before I sell things, I guess. Okay, so these are the same. I don't want to sell those boots. These boots are slightly better. Okay. Okay, now I think we're good to sell most of the other stuff. You're here about food. Take it up with that I know. I, I know. got other gear to sell. We're making progress, though. We're making progress selling our things here. Leather helm. Chainmail gloves. Chainmail gloves. Leather boots. Chainmail boots. Leather armor. Chainmail. Up. How, why are my wedding clothes two copper and my regular clothes are one silver and 37 copper? I feel like wedding clothes should be a lot more expensive than your everyday clothing. I mean, right? And I don't need a wedding ring anymore. Kind of sad, but I don't. Hey, thanks for hosting me, Louie Man, and welcome to the stream. Um, I mean, I feel like I want to keep my healing potions and the lyrium potions for Morrigan. Because I assume that's how that works. But I just don't know enough about, like, these runes and everything else. Okay, things like Malachite Quartz, are these just for selling? Let's see, the stone is patterned with odd bands and 
ripples of color like the contents of a witch's cauldron, quartz, a milky white stone of remarkable strength. Yeah, uh, if you, if anyone knows and wants to answer that, are things like malachite and quartz, are they just for selling? Like the amethyst here. Must be a wedding with a tight budget. They were definitely on a tight budget, but still, like, why is wedding, you know, a wedding dress more expensive, or less expensive than regular clothing? Yeah, because it would be pretty nice to just get, like, 20, 20 silver off of him. In the meantime, though, don't suppose you have a backpack, sir. You have a shiny gold ring. Whoa. You can use them for some other things, but right now you can just go ahead and sell them. Um, okay, I'll sell them if I need to, then. I'm thinking this guy might not have a backpack, though. This is just all, right? Yeah, all non-plot items. Backpack, backpack. Backpack, backpack. Doesn't look like he has one. Bit of a shame, that. Don't know much about Dragon Age. No, that's fair. I don't know much about Dragon Age either. <laughs> um. Well, we tried. We certainly tried. Why does he still have an exclamation point? Food. Is there anything else I should be asking him? I've got other gear to sell. Not any well-paying work. Check the chanter's board by the chantry. There's good jobs, huh? Um. <clears throat> no. Don't suppose you know anything about uh, poison? Um, I have dabbled in such things. I figured if I kept asking, I'd find someone. I'd pay good coin for some simple poison. Something to slow them beasties down or make them think twice. Um, any idea where I could get ingredients? Well, there's herbs in the north wood. As for other stuff... Look can also give my town. companions gifts to clear Some inventory space. Just left things behind to travel faster. I don't really know what you need, though. I, I might have some in stock, too. Farewell. Alright, peace out. I'm leaving. Is there a skeleton to loot? No. I think it's too early to give a companions gifts. I don't care that much about any of them yet. I mean, if anything, it would really just be like, here, hold this. <laughs> if you happen to like it, cool. Cue outro, go!